So I'm Tom DeFreston, I'm an artist and a writer who's been working on this project with Christiana, Pablo and Mariah. And this is one of about 50 paintings that emerged from the process. All very similar in that they're these masked, uh, kind of burnt, cut out figures that combine paint and photography. It might be interesting just to know kind of how they, how they emerged, I suppose, what the genealogy is. So I actually started by reading Christiana's book, which is all about Western portrayals of terrorism, how we construct and control symbols and meaning um, particularly kind of binaries of good and evil and the complexities of these. And Christian and I look to apply that thinking to the aftermath of the Manchester attacks, in particular the newspaper headlines and how they try to fit into and um, stabilise these binaries in a way of literally purity and evil. And we started initially with drawing, so after the kind of conceptualising of it, I drew a series of masks which were um, laid on top of each other ideas of what an evil face looks like, ideas of what a pure face looks like. So we constructed a kind of an encyclopedia of through history of how these have been formed. And what we wanted to do was conflate those. So we start to problematize them and create, create these characters who combine the two. That very quickly didn't feel sufficient. And early on we realized that we maybe needed to respond to the material in a way with methods that were appropriate to the, to the attack. So almost we wanted to commit commit acts of trauma onto the material. We wanted to almost explode our sources so that we could re-piece them back together, so that we weren't being illustrative. What that literally meant was me staging a series of performances and films and photographing myself where I constructed these disguises, where I would combine, um, I would combine aesthetics from Snapchat filters, I would combine aesthetics from out, throughout our history of figures of good and evil and you know, pulling tights over my head, pulling paint and clay and bits of chicken wire. So I became these almost composite zombie characters. Those films led to me creating a series of stills and photographs of almost like this cast of characters who I'd become. And then from those photographs, I started to work paint into them. So I was deforming them, distorting them, abstracting them further. And it was at that point that I realized that I wanted to start to work into these with fire, with a blowtorch, with, to start to distort them further so that you end up with these kind of almost archival fragments so that together they all feel as if they are fractal things, that you're only seeing a, a tiny element of the picture. And the broad sense of what Christian and I were after doing was trying to get to the, the fact that the emotional psychological experience of these attacks is not simplistic it is the word sublime is kind of relevant because they are they're overwhelming they're not possible to order and we wanted to get back somewhere towards that chaos somewhere towards that inexpressibility